All right, guys, Michael back here. Um, another Saturday morning project. Uh, I'm out here working in the, on my blackberries right now. Um, I've been working on this. Uh, you, if you've seen before, I drug up some pine straw from raking the yard. And um, I'd actually planned on, I was going to burn it over where I'm going to plant my tomatoes. And after that, add a little bit of potash or, you know, whatever helped maybe amend the soil there a little bit with some some nutrients and help the pH over there a little bit. But I decided to go ahead and use that pine straw here on my blackberries. I was just looking at it and I had to do something. And um, pine straw is the answer for me. So at least here in Southern Arkansas, we got a plenty of it. So um, what, I, what I've done here, just real easy. Just uh, had a bunch of pine straw piled up, dumped it around the plants. I got a few areas I'm gonna fill in. And then um, I'm also gonna come in, I'm gonna put a trellis up. That's what I'm about to start working on right now so where i'm gonna do this trellis i'm gonna build it just like uh, uh texas prepper 2 if you ever watched any of his videos he's a, a bit of a blackberry guru and uh, i love watching his videos if he catches this i uh, hope he hope he's hope i do him some, a little bit of justice here but uh he does a great job on all of his videos you gotta go check him out if you've never watched him but um what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna set two t posts here on either end on this end and on the other end and then I might uh, put two in the middle and I'm gonna set those, I don't know, probably about 20, 20 inches apart, I think is what he had done on his. So something along those lines. And then I'm gonna run me some wire down, down the line here to help support my blackberries. So let's get started. All right, if you need to get your heart rate up, go drive you some T-Post. But you'll see, I put them in at an angle on both ends. And my thinking is that'll help add a little tension when, I, when I'm pulling on the line. Texas Prepper 2 did that too. And uh, so I got them all in there at an angle. Just as a side of it, here's my apple tree. I'm gonna prune that thing and I also need to put a uh, T-post on it to straighten it up a little bit. It's uh, leaning on me. The wind blew it over. So, anyway, I'm going to get me two, two more T-posts driven and um, come back and run my wire. All right, guys, so I got my trellis put up there and uh, I was going to use some wire, but then I, I don't think I've got, got enough. I was going to go buy some that. I remember I've got this poly twine that I used on my electric fence. I just used it. I think it's going to be fine. Um, looks good. Um, you can see here, I can just sort of ease these these vines in there. And if I if I want to, when they get a little bit taller, I might I might put another run, run up here just to, just to straighten it up just a little bit more, but they're really looking good. I'm hoping, 
had some a little bit better luck on the black bears this year um you know last year was their first year and so i didn't expect much but um we'll see what happens um but i think this looks pretty good i'm just going down through here and, and uh getting them pick getting vines picked up so they start growing right and uh, i mean they've got buds showing on them i'm probably going to come in here like i said we've got some rain supposed to be some rain coming in um I'm going to, I think I'm going to put just a little bit of triple 13 around the base of each plant under this pine straw and uh, let that rain sort of water that down in there and uh, and we'll see what happens on, on that. So anyway, uh, I'm going to close this video out. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Please, 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 please do me a favor. Get down there and uh, hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed, if you enjoy my content here. It's not much, but it's a little bit of of uh, garden ramblings as i like to call it and um just uh if you'll do that I, I would really appreciate it leave me a comment if you stop by and i'll catch you on the next video goodbye